Hey guys, another video here. Um, today I'm working on a 2020 Mazda 3. So we're gonna add a new key. So customer lost uh, all the keys, but we're just gonna add a new key. Because if you delete, if you go to all, all keys lost or delete all the keys in the system, you'll require two. So we're just gonna add um, a key. So that way we just require one key. So, you know, if if you don't have any keys program, the ignition won't turn on at all. So the only way to do that is, so you have to, um, got, you have to select the car manually. So I went to manually right here and then we, I went to, oops, to master three and then 2020, this right here, 2019 album smart key so and then so without um the ignition on you you won't be able to um you won't be able to program the key because um automatically it'll it'll fail um because it's gonna try to act to get access to the to the module and then you won't have that access so you have to have the ignition key on so if you go right here add key everything right here is gonna go through except uh the access the security access you won't you won't go go through so it, it doesn't go through because the ignition is not on so since you don't have any keys you won't be able to turn it on so the way that you're gonna turn on the ignition it's you go to emo learning right here emo learning right there keyless system and then we're gonna turn the ignition on you go there automatically it'll tell you okay when if this if the ignition cannot be turned on use this function to turn it first lead. so yeah so you just put okay it'll tell you what to do so just hold it for 10 seconds and then when you hold it for 10 seconds the light blue you start flashing it'll tell you on the scanner on the programmer after 10 seconds, you just hold, uh, after 10 seconds, let it go and push it back and the, the ignition turn, it'll turn on. So yeah, and then just go to add, add keys, smart keys. So yeah, and then after you, um, it'll take like maybe 20 minutes because now like, yeah, like 20 minutes to access in the system. So I'm just gonna do this. And then, um, program the key so just follow the procedure it says press the brake and put the the smart key right to the push button so yeah and then the key is gonna be programmed it's gonna get programmed so yeah so that's yeah see right here that's mazda it's ford so all right guys i hope this video gave you some information like and subscribe for more videos like this take care